This is a copper storm pipe outfall uh, in Clareton, Pennsylvania. It's 435 feet of 48 inch motorized SBU. We decided to go with the motorized because uh, uh, the grounds conditions call for it. We are uh, expecting about 60 to 90 feet of red clay, sandy clay, uh, and then we hope to get into the uh, Pittsburgh claystone, uh, which is a moderately soft, soft shale. We've worked with the Robbins Company for about the last 12 years. Uh, we've done approximately, I'd say, a dozen of the motorized SBUs and more like uh, 20 to 22 standard SBU jobs. So we like them. The uh, controllability for line and grade really helps us out quite a bit. They cut rock really well. The head itself, the articulating part, uh, we control it from the inside. We can adjust for line and grade by the swivel of the machine. We can go up and down, left and right, any direction we want to go. Uh, the bore machine actually just advances the casing. There's an invert auger which brings the spoil out and ejects it into the pit, which we then clam out. So we bore 20 foot. Uh, lengths of casing. We get 20 feet up, we check the line and grade continuously as we're going through. We can make adjustments every 6 to 10 feet is what we normally go by. And um, we make another weld when 20 feet's in. We have no need to pull auger or anything like that like you would with a conventional bore. So we can monitor it at all times and that saves us a lot of time. Uh, Robbins came out and got us familiar with the machine because we've run this machine off of them. It's a little bit different from ours. So they come back and run us through it. Well, they have a, a box down there that tells you how much torque is on the head, how much pressure it's taking to turn the head, keep it right around 60%. And that's, that's when I know when to push the machine and how fast to push it. The advantages to the SBU uh, you can go long distance without worrying about a big auger turning and braking. Because when you have long distances, the torque builds up a lot. We have all those strung out there. Well, the SBU, it all cuts right in the head end. It doesn't matter if this thing is in 50 feet or 500 feet, the head knows no difference. There's not a lot of pressure on the machine because it's just pushing casing. It's not turning a 48 inch auger 500 feet away. It's turning a 12 inch auger 500. So the stress on the transmission on the gearbox is minimal compared to trying to conventional board with a Christmas tree or a roller cone head. With the motorized we're able to keep it very close on line and grade and of course that's our big thing. We do a lot of gravity sewers that have to be close. So um, we're right on it sometimes, and we're able to do that with this particular method.